Hi everyone, just wanted to uh, show a tree I acquired a few months back and uh, wanted to do the video now because it's got a little bit of everything going on all at the same time. Um, this is called a sourwood tree. It's a small tree. Um, the botanical name is um, Ox Oxydendron arboreum and uh, it's a native tree to Pennsylvania, probably down to about South Carolina and uh, over to the maybe parts of uh, Louisiana and stuff like that. Um, but it's perfectly hardy here. It's a uh, hardy from USDA zone 5A and uh, up probably to nine or so. And uh, cool tree. I mean, the fall color on this is absolutely outstanding. Um, one of the reasons why you don't see this commonly planted in uh, my area, which is Southern Ontario, is because it uh, requires really acidic soil. So I did my very best to amend the soil with uh, certain matter like peat moss and other, a few other things. Um, but uh, I don't have high hopes for it because the, the ground is naturally high in pH because it's limestone. But uh, anyway, I wanted to give it a try. Um, wasn't cheap. Uh, this is about a six foot tree and uh, cost me about $300, but uh, it's worth it if it... Uh, if it takes off okay uh it's going to be great um, one of the great characteristics about this plant is the fall color um, it'll produce really awesome maroon reds uh, that just uh, completely overtake the tree uh, the flowers are very interesting you can see the uh, some of them have gotten the seed but the tips of the flower stalks there are still in flower and uh, those st flower stalks will persist even when the um, the trees in full fall color which uh and it stays white so it's kind of an interesting background on the deep red maroon foliage uh the, the leaves themselves are really amazing they're uh, very glossy and uh, leathery uh so it makes it a quite an interesting uh, appearance probably grow around uh, up to 30 feet tall I'm not so sure it's gonna grow that tall here but we'll see but uh anyway great tree um, sourwood. So if you, uh, if you happen to live in a place that has acidic soil naturally and are in USDA zone 5 A and up, I would highly recommend grabbing this tree. It's, uh, it's outstanding. Anyway, I hope everybody's having a great day. Take care.